Greb Airport is only 11 kilometres from the city centre. Straightforward and easy to get to. We grabbed an airport transfer off the Artor and it was really easy. Hey guys, welcome to Zagreb Airport in the capital of Croatia. Uh, pretty much a brand new airport, only been opened a few years. It's got a nice wavy roof which apparently represents the waves of the coastline here. So let's go inside and have a little bit of a look. So information desk, coffee shop, there's actually a coffee shop outside as well. And a media shop up there that sells smokes, suitcases, all the usual stuff you'd find at the airport. I uh, found it really easy to check in. There wasn't too many people here and there's not a great deal of flights going in and out of here. Of course, I can't see the board very well, but there's like, yeah, flight every 15 minutes or so, so nothing over the top. There's about 30 bag drops, mainly for Croatian Air Airlines. Check-in kiosks if you like to check in that way. It's a little bit hard sometimes for us because we were just checking in by laptop so I didn't have a printer. So, But they were nice enough to print out our boarding passes for us with no problems at all. Upstairs there is departure so we'll have to show our boarding passes in a minute before we go and check into the departure area. So it be interesting to see what's up there. I actually like the roof, the metal framing looks really nice and modern. It's a fair bit of empty space in here, um, maybe they'll build it for capacity later on, but at this stage they certainly don't seem to need it. And here they are, sitting here waiting for me to finish doing a bit of filming. Oh, surprise, surprise, duty free. No surprise that the women of Wild Family Travel all love a good duty free store. Love having a look around, love seeing what's on special. But the duty free is a grabs like many other duty frees in every other airport. Alcohol, cigarettes, perfume, really good selection and at really good prices. So as you pass through duty free you'll find a smoking cabin. It's a shop called Spread which looks like a bit of a delicatessen canteen selling a whole range of uh, different Croatian foods, burgers, drinks, sandwiches, you name it. It's a fashion space shop selling all different types of clothes, sneakers. We went here in the Brewmark, so a bit of a bar selling burgers, all the usual sort of stuff. Then there's a Cafe Nero selling pastries, coffees, etc. Then you come out into the main boarding area, big glass windows to watch the planes. So apparently we've got around 22 no i can't say that 28 boarding gates so let's go and have a look at which one we're at today toilets out here plenty of seating okay so our 1445 flight to frankfurt is from gate 21 so we are up this way right at the end, which will be good. That'll give us a good view of some planes. Okay, so really nice airport. Simple, not very big, um, a few shops, lots of seating, really good glass windows, I guess, for watching planes landing and arriving. But I quite enjoy airports this size, you know, you can't get lost in them. Facilities here are enough to handle the traffic that comes through. So yeah, quite a, definitely a good airport to depart or land in, get out easy, find what you want. There's a lounge there for people in higher grade than what we fly. <laughs> so heading up to our Gate 21. 